Kabataan part is vehemently condemns and rejects the extension of martial law in Mindanao. It is but a part of the tactic scheme of the regime to further consolidate its political power. It's a collective decision made by the partilist representation. So it was uh, decided by uh, the national or organizations who founded the, uh, the partilist. I know that I'm not alone and I'll never be alone in uh, this huge responsibility of representing the youth sector, the sole youth uh, representation in the 17th Congress. We have um, national organizations based in schools and it, in communities that forms the uh, the constituency, the solid constituency of Kabataan Partilist. So, uh, yun po yung nakatulong din sa akin at uh, nagbibigay ng lakas ng loob kasi hindi madali. Kaya, uh, yung strength, we draw strength from the unity of the students, of young people from different uh, sectors. Best part is how we are able to maximize uh, the seat that we have here in the House of Representatives to buttress and bolster the youth and student movement nationwide. So whatever uh, campaigns uh, they have on education, uh, social services, uh, governance, the call for accountability, extension lang yung office namin. So kung ano yung magbigay namin na suporta, ibigay natin yan, di ba? Sa tingin ko, bilang isang uh, kabataan na aktibo na nagsasalita sa iba't ibang mga issues, nagkaroon ako ng, ng pagtingin at nagbigay din ng affirmation sa akin yung pagiging member ng Congress na tama na hindi lang dapat mag-rely doon sa uh, mga actions na ginagawa dito sa Congress, kundi best part is to be awakened by the reality that we really need to shape public opinion, influence people's behavior, continue to inform educate and mobilize our ranks and to support pro-people agenda. Hindi sapat yung ginagawa sa loob ng Congress. Dapat talaga yung public support. Yan yung pinakakailangan. And public vigilance as well. To me, a woman is a fighter.